Hi, I'm Mike Brohard, Ram Wire Insider. Welcome to the Rams Film Room, presented by PDS. We're joined today by soccer coach Bill Hempen and, and coach. The restart rule is got it's not black and white. There's some gray area. And there were a couple instances this year, back-to-back -back games against Air Force and Fresno, where your players were smart enough to take advantage of that. Can you walk us through what happened each game? Yeah, uh, one of the first things we tell our kids uh, when the whistle blows, you, know, you, you hear play to the whistle, well, we have to try and play a little beyond that. Mm -hmm. And because uh, our game can be restarted without a whistle. And not a lot of people look at it that way. Um, we had a foul right here at the top of the 18 yard box. And what I always tell our players is do not ask for 10 yards, because once you ask for 10 yards, the game has to re be restarted with the, uh, with the referee's whistle. A lot of things happen in here. The, the natural movement of the defensive players is to put their head down, they, they exhale a little bit. I look at this right here, you've got a goalie standing on a post setting up a wall. If there was a space for, this is KK, I believe, over the ball, uh, she's right in here, uh, she, and she feels like she can knock it into that empty net, we let them. If you see it, take it. Obviously there was a, a, too much of a, a group of players in here for her to do that, so she waited and waited, still did not ask for 10. See, Taylor is right here, and all of a sudden there's a gap that opens up. KK sees her, plays her through, and it's a golasso. And a great finish. Again, those in front of the goal like that are not the easiest to, uh, to finish, and she did a real good job. Same thing right here, a game later, a free kick just outside the 18 yard box, goalkeeper on the post. I tell our goalkeepers, do not do not do that. <laughs> Stay in the middle of the goal. And I tell our players to be five yards away from the set piece. And uh, the, the reason I do that is because five yards probably not gonna get you a yellow. Mm -hmm. But if you stand right on top of the ball and don't move, you're probably gonna get a yellow. Okay. So they're in a space where they can, um, you know, defend, they're, they're, they're made aware of everything that's going on, keeper stays here, referee says, you know, points to his whistle or on my whistle, now the keeper can jump over here and set up the wall. This is Fresno, no, we have not asked for 10, KK's paying attention, I think she plays the ball to Gracie, and Gracie sticks it in, right away. And everybody's mad at the referee, and I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> So it's a, a good, a, a, you know, just one of those games you've got to take advantage of, uh, or one of those parts of the game that you have to be aware of and take full advantage of, and we did in back-to-back -back games a year ago. In both of these instances, it's KK on the ball. You put a lot of trust in her. You liked her, I guess, soccer IQ to read these situations for what they needed to be. Um, sp speak a little bit about how she really kind of made both of these plays happen. Yeah, that's, you know, we, we, we use the term field awareness a lot with our, with our team. And that's one of those moments that you have to know what's going on. It's just like, you gotta know what the score is, you gotta know what, how much time's left. You have a free kick, you wanna get the most out of that free kick. She'll usually take those if we ask for, for 10, because I think she had the, has the most accurate shot on, on this particular group of kids. But you get that movement and that, um, anxious moment for a defense like that, you take full advantage of it. And she saw it, and uh, I think you know she's she was constantly looking for that quick service. And you know it takes some of, some of our attacking players. It only takes one, uh, you know, because even some of our players, you know, the head goes down a little bit, and they realize, oh my goodness. But there's if I've got two players on the same page in that particular scenario, like we had with Gracie uh, and then against Air Force uh, with Taylor. And that makes it, is, uh, you know, it really catches them and it's, it's tough to come back from something like that. Well, thanks for joining us in the, in the film room, Coach. Thank you.